Well, it's cold again. Ah, gobble gobble. It's a good thing they don't fly really, isn't it? <laughs> I think they'd be gone. It is here. Yeah. Oh, hello. Yep. He's all like, hey, is that a camera? How much they are? Each? Uh. Yeah, 25 quid a hen. Wow. Yeah. So how, how much are the eggs at the moment? I'm selling four for uh, £1.35 they are boxed up. Oh, that's get, pretty. Yeah, that's pretty good. They get people in as well. They're buying the ones eggs to hatch out as well. Yeah. Hatching their own out. Ah. Got a load of incubator at Marvin. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Got about uh, 50, 50 chicks in another ten days. Wow. <laughs> God, there's going to be chickens everywhere. So there you go, Riverside Garden Centre. What junction of Mosway? Junction 4. Junction 4, the, yeah, of course it is. It's Ewood. Get off at Ewood. <laughs> yeah, Junction 4 of the motorway, Lower Darwin, Blackburn. There we go. Uh, Google Riverside Garden Centre, Blackburn, Darwin. Uh, I think it's as easy as that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so I've just been to my friend's garden centre, as you've just seen. Uh, you know, in uh, Darwin. Uh, Lower Darwin, actually. And uh, yeah, I haven't been there for a while. I, I should really check it out more because I didn't know he had hens now. I mean, he sells all sorts of uh, sheds, everything, uh, you know, fish. Yeah, Graham that you just saw, I went to school with him. Uh, he's, he was in my class at school. And uh, yeah, we've been friends for years. So I'm having lunch uh, with a friend uh, in about an hour. But uh, I'm going to see if I can do a car before, uh, before then. So I've done three cars today, so yay! And I've got a couple more booked in so for the rest of the week. Things are really, really looking up, so I'm really, really happy about that. Uh, I went out for lunch. Uh, I uh, went out for lunch with a friend, we went to uh, Frankie and Betty's. Oh, it was beautiful, beautiful food. I forgot how good it was in there. It's like the uh, the British version of, uh, it's like Olive Garden, you know, but it's, uh, it's Frankie and Betty's, you know. Yeah, I didn't film anything while I was in uh, Frankie and Betty's uh, with a friend, because, uh, well, it's uh, kind of personal, so. Yeah, I left it alone. <laughs> So, I'm wondering whether to go out tonight or not. I mean, it's the uh, Thursday night singers night. Um, well, it's it's the Thursday night folk night at the uh, local folk club. Um, well, it's not really that local to me, but it's, it's about eight miles away, but still local enough, you know. And uh, there's a bunch of people which go there which I haven't seen in years, so uh, it'd be really, really nice to go there. Um, you know, I need to practice my folk songs. Yeah, so I'm waiting for a call back now, uh, just to see whether I am doing five cars tomorrow, or just one. <laughs> I've, just, I've just found out that I'm uh, driving back up to Paythorn, you know, Gisborne again, um, tomorrow. And I was hoping to get three cars there, because, uh, you know, it's, it's a bit far to travel just for a one. But it's okay, because on the way back, um, I have two to do on the way back, so that's quite good. So, there we go. Quack, quack. So, I'm totally filling up my van again. <laughs> so, just remembered uh, I had to fill up my van again, so uh, that's what I'm doing right now. So, uh, I don't have to put too much in there, so I'm going to put the universal amount in, which uh, is not too much, that the van's going to use a lot of fuel, and uh, is not too little if I get one extra car than I'm expecting. So, I'm expecting to do three tomorrow, but if I do more, so uh, 300 litres should easily be able to do four cars. Although I generally put an extra 50 litres in there just to, uh, you know, be on the safe side, because there's the whole gravity issue. Uh, you know, if I park in the pavement, uh, the gravity is not going through, and uh, the outlet is on the left side, the passenger side, so I have to make sure I go on the wrong side of the road to park on the, <laughs> to park on the pavement. So, yeah. Okay, so I just had a huge diet fail. Uh, yeah, uh, I decided, you know, um, I, I should be, like, really, really good, you know, so I've been good all day, I was good all day yesterday, uh, day before, no, um, actually, yeah, I was good the day before, you don't believe me, ask Sarah. 
Although Sarah will probably comment on this video, so... Yeah. Yeah, Sarah, tell everybody I was a good boy. Do you get what I'm talking about? Because I don't. Yeah, so, uh, I just had myself a nice piece of chocolate cake from my party the other day. And you can't eat chocolate cake without ice cream. I mean, come on, it's, 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 it's chocolate cake and ice cream. I mean, come on. It's... Don't look at me like that. Stop it. Stop it. Stop judging me. So I've decided against going out. Now there is a reason for that. Uh, I'm going out tomorrow night instead. Uh, I'm going to a uh, Chinese buffet. Please tell me I didn't just say buffet. I'm going to a Chinese buffet. Yes. And uh, all you can eat one of those things. Yeah. Uh, I'm not going out tonight, so I'm limiting my nights out. Uh, so, uh, I'm off out with the same person I went to have lunch with earlier. So, um, yeah, that seems to be going well. It's not too late, but I could do with, uh, practicing some music. I could do with reading at least a couple of chapters of my book. It's been three months since I started it. No, actually, it's probably more like four months now. So, yeah, so, uh, good night, take care, and have fun. Say goodnight, ducky. Wow.